Merlin, Lancelot, Guinevere, oh, well, maybe not. So I thought it was about time I had a good old hike, a walk. It's not that far actually. I'm at St. Materiana's Church. Tin Tingel. Tintagenal. Tin 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 and um, this is the National Trust car park just along the coast, not far to walk to Tintagenal. I can't even say it. You know, you know what I mean. The old King Arthur thing. So I'm going to have a little wander around the church because I do like dead people. They're much quieter and don't give me as much jib. So I'm going to have a look around there, take a few photos if there's anything it's all misty and uh and then get on down to the the big action further down the road i do like an old church don't you hey can't beat a church possibly the most beautiful church I've ever been in just saying if you get a chance the church of whatever I said earlier I'll put it here uh, Tintagenal Tintagel Tintagel not Tintagenal Tintagel yeah really nice Police of Kings. We're King of the Mist. Again, the mist has beaten me. But that is where King Arthur, the true and only King of England, once resided. If you believe in that, I do. I uh, believe in the Knights of the Round Table. I knew a group of uh, gamblers called the Knights of the Round Table, and they fleece me. So, um, yeah, you can't even see the bridge over because that is spectacular. But I'll give it one more go. You can just see the bridge here, but maybe not. I'll try it on the other camera, but oh, that is a sight. So, I'm going to walk on round, take a few pics here first, even in the mist and see if I can get anything but um, weather right one last shot of uh, the 23 pound King Arthur's Castle did I say that 23 pounds I mean it's only 23 pounds to get in okay enough about the 23 pounds but it's important I know can't pay for both of us anyway I've final shot if the Sun comes out which has been coming in and out in and out in and out so I'm going to try and get this one over here uh, yeah so at the moment obviously it's a bit um, crap isn't it but when the light hits I'm thinking it might be okay so I'm going to sit here for a bit, have a drink, and try and frame something up in readiness for the light through the mist.
I've literally just been attacked by a swarm of killer flying ants at Tintagel Castle. So it's a sign. It's a sign to move on. I've had to do a runner. Run. Oh, they're everywhere. Look, bastards. Merlin. Lancelot. Gwynevit. Oh, well, maybe not. It's a bit of a, a, bit of a sword carrier. I might fight back. Right. That's it. Tintagel. I'm going to rename it. Tintagel 23 pounds. Hmm. Cheers. I've just seen a bloke absolutely totally covered in flying ants. I've never seen a man more infested with ants. But as I was walking down, I have passed back past the church. I was going to go the other direction. I've just seen this. This is a strange little bit of ground and I'm going to be very careful as I walk up to it oh I think there's some bloody birds here and everything and and it's just some lone puppies just on their own I think this is a grave I've got a feeling this is a grave I feel quite bad standing on it it's definitely something here an old building of sorts definitely how bizarre. The lady I just met said that there's a load of bunkers uh, from World War II all set out along here. It's me thinking it's a grave because the church is there. In fact, these are all old bunkers, but this was all covered up and lost because of the uh, growth. And then it's only since the fire that it's come back. Symbolic, really. Anyway, I've taken a few. Hopefully some of them come out with the old Tamron macro one-to-one. <laughs> 90 mil prime to give it its official name. So that's it for, to, for today. I'm going to go and find a, a park up there. Apparently, there's one near a pub or in the car park of a pub, and it's five quid. And I'm quite fancying a couple of ciders, to be honest. It's been hot. Even my watch is sweating. And um, I thought I'd get myself a meal and a couple of ciders, if it's open and open to suggestion of a £5 meal deal, which is much cheaper than £23 for Tintagel Castle. All right. So hopefully some of those pictures will come out. And if they have, they'll be on the 50 and Nifty website link, the hub. Yeah, on the hub and um, also over on Instagram. Should be up there. And if any of them are any decent, they might make uh, for the running of the 50th image that I've been looking for on this this uh, tour of the UK. You never know. Those uh, poppies are looking promising, but I can only see it on the screen so far. Right, so that's it. Goodbye from Tintagel. I'll catch you uh, next time. Um, and no doubt you'll see me in the pub later for a pint. All right, cheers, take care, bye.